Hey, what's going on, everybody? BD Cool Two One Three here, and I'm back with some more of the Marvel vs. Capcom Fighting Collection. All right, so let's go ahead and continue with the very first Marvel vs. Capcom. Here we go. Marvel vs. Capcom: Lives of Superheroes. I still remember the little uh, little donut shop that I used to go to out here in uh, in LA called Lucky Donut that had this arcade machine. Man, I never wanted an arcade machine so bad until I saw this game. I really wanted that damn machine in my house back in the day because it was it was such a cool game to see. I mean, I mean, I mean, seeing Mega Man in this game, I was like, dude, I love Mega Man back on the NES, and just seeing it, seeing him in the fighting game with like Spider Man, Hulk, Gambit, and Wolverine, just blew my mind back in the day. Yeah, but um, yeah. Well, I mean, throughout the years, I mean, I guess I had a couple of. Uh, versions of um, Marvel vs. Capcom. But I never had that arcade machine in my house <laughs> to this day. <laughs> All right, so um, yeah, so far I've been picking this layout, so I guess I'll stick with that. All right. Oh, let me check out that marquee card real quick. Is that what it looked like, really? <laughs> I must have played that arcade machine so many times. I don't remember that. Like I'm looking at the the picture at the top, the top part in the middle with the those characters, that red, black, and blue character. I don't remember that, but all right, I guess that must have been what it was on what was on the machine, I guess. All right. Let's do this. Capcom presents. Capcom presents. Ah, uh, but yeah, I would go like every day after school just to play this game to that little donut shop called, called Lucky Donut, which is not even there anymore. It's a, I think it's a wing stop now. All right, so uh, let's see, who am I going to pick? Oh, you know what? I mentioned Mega Man. Let's go with Mega Man and um, you know what, guys? A wise man once said, I'm about to make a name for myself here, so Gambit. I just want to make sure people know what happened here today, all right, guys? So yeah, let's go with Mega Man and Gambit. But yeah, God, I swear, it feels like every day after school, like in, you know, when I was in junior high school, that I used to go to that donut shop back in the day and play this game. Man, like, yeah, I really wanted that arcade machine so bad. <laughs> Never had it. Maybe one day I'll get it. Maybe. I mean, I know they have that, like, arcade one-up, you know, arcade machines, but no, I want the real thing. I want that real one. But back in the day... Man, Zangie's not really trying. Alright, hold on a second, hold on a second, hold on. Oh, I was gonna kick his ass right now. Alright, here we go. Nope, not that, not that. Oh, come on, man. There we go. That blew my mind, too. I was like, whoa, you call it your partner? Like, really? That's dope. Damn, just like that. Holy crap. Yeah, it seems like, um, I don't know, these games started to feel better. Like, the the flow, like, the way it plays and stuff, compared to, like, the earlier games, you know, with, like, X-Men Trouble of the Atom and stuff. It felt better. It felt more fast-paced, I guess. Alright. Oh, come on! Psylocke should have saved my- Oh! Ah, the way I still hit him anyway. I, know, I guess he can't flinch sometimes. You gotta hit him. Uh, you gotta hit him a little bit harder, I guess. Uh, Hulk, I mean. Nice. Uh, he didn't take the full effect of that though. Woo! Whoa! Come on! Damn! I thought he was about to block that for a second. It's showtime. Yeah, Gam is a big fan of Beetlejuice as well. Yeah. Oh, 
No! Credit card! I know it's kinetic card, by the way. <laughs> I, I mentioned that in my uh, X-Men vs. Street Fighter playthrough, of course. But even then, it sounded like credit card, and a lot of people that I, you know, that play this game, I heard from that. Even they thought it was that Gambit was saying credit card. And he is. Ready. It's not kinetic card, guys. Yeah. Damn, I forget how many how many hits you could go for if you charge up the Mega Buster like like that. I remember doing that a while back, but uh, I forget how many hits like it goes up to like if you manage to store it all the way. Uh oh, oh no, I was gonna go for the uh, that one. Ah, uh, wait, what? Why did it seem like Mega Man didn't even do anything? He turned into... Uh, whatever the hell it's called. But... I don't know. I just saw Gambit throw a bunch of cards, that's it. Uh oh! Oh, wrong move. Not the trick card. Drill claw! He's on block the whole time. No wrong move! Hyper Mega Man, that's what it was called. I forgot the name of that Piper combo. Man, am I gonna breeze through this game? <laughs> it feels like we're going a little bit too fast. Ah, oh, man, but you know, even though I own Marvel vs. Street Fighter at home, I still felt like I played this game more than that game. Ready. And yeah, I never actually got the the PlayStation version of this game. My dad actually bought me the Dreamcast version, like, uh, I think it was in 2000. And yeah, I guess I played the hell out of that game that it eventually just stopped working. Yeah. I don't know, I think my, oh my god. I think my Dreamcast might have been a little bit messed up, or the, the CD drive, I guess, was uh, messed up. Or what are they called, the Dreamcast discs? GDs, I guess? GD ROMs? Something like that. Yeah, eventually the game just stopped working for me for some reason. I was pretty sad for a bit, but then I got uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 2. So, yeah. Wasn't that sad for that long. No! Oh, no! Should have went the other way. Oh, oh. Oh, did I? Wait, is it not possible to get both of them when they're out like that? Damn, I thought she wouldn't block that. No! Oh! Woo! Man, I thought that little fireball of hers was gonna hurt me. Oh, Strider's theme is badass in this game. I love Strider's game too. Strider was the the game of, like from from uh, Sega Genesis is pretty cool. I guess it's based on the arcade game that he had too. I think I might have actually seen his arcade game, like in that like in an actual arcade once, but. Uh, Never played it though, but I think it's the exact same thing as the Sega Genesis version. Or Mega Drive if you're from Europe, I guess. Europe or Japan. Oh crap. Ooh. Oh. Crap, so what would be playing? Oh, never mind. I'm trying not to lose a partner. So I'm trying to see if I can get one of the uh, secret battles. Ah, oh, I didn't transform in time. So yeah, if I'm lucky in the battle right before the, the boss fight, the final boss fight, um, we'll get like a secret battle, depending on what the requirements, I guess. Which I have no idea. <laughs> I know one of the requirements is don't lose a, don't lose a partner. That's it. Uh oh. Yo, I pushed him back. What the? Oh, okay, well he did get pushed back, but still got hit anyway. Man, that Street Fighter 2 theme is so awesome, man. The music was so good in this game. Well, I mean, I guess it was good in all of the versus games, but uh, yeah, man, that, that theme is pretty dope. That remix is pretty dope.
No! Don't bring it back yet! Dude, I'm trying to go for Kazen Slash. Thank you. <laughs> What's the point? I missed anyway. Huh, so far I haven't been lucky at getting like uh, the little points you could get right here in this part. Like if you manage to strike a pose, you know, at the right time, like a specific pose, you'll get like a certain number of extra points. Come on. So far, no luck with that though. Wait, how do you do? Yeah, that one. Yeah, so much for that. Well, at least I got chip damage, I guess. Nice. Yeah, like it can still charge us up anyway, even though I'm getting hit anyway. Oh. oh, what? Dude, what? I thought I was safe right there. Better not block this. Ah, of course. Oh, crap, not again. Damn. Oh, surprise. I really was expecting him to block that, too. <laughs> All right, come on, Gambito. Crap. Oh my god, I remember War Machine blocking a lot in this game. Him and Chun Li, <laughs> they would block a, a whole lot. No, oh, oh, whoops. Oh, all right. Thankfully, he didn't block that one. Crap, crap. Nice. Oh, my God. Woo, damn, that was close. <laughs> uh, I guess he was going for um, Cajun Strike. Yeah, I think that's what the name of that move. Okay, here we go. Let's see who we're going to fight. I bet it's going to be Lilith, Morgan's sister. Yeah, let's see. We are I always used to get her a lot. Yeah, it's her again. Yeah, Lilith. Lilith and... I don't know if their partner is uh, Shadow or Sentinel, or the, the not the not the special partner. I mean the special partner is what I meant. You know, like how I have Psylocke. Yeah. Oh, it's Shadow. Okay. Charlie, Nash, Shadow, Charlie, Nash. All right, Chun Li, you want to block everything? Just like how I remember you would you would block all like pretty much every single move I would do on her. I wouldn't be surprised if this ends in a uh, timeout. <laughs> yep, like I said, I really hated fighting Chun Li in this game. Like, really. Oh, no. Yeah, I remember that combo, too. Damn, I still went for Royal Flush. Oh, wow, okay. Nice! Alright, cool. How do I do Cajun Strike? 
Wait, I forget how you bounce between the different walls. I don't remember. Oh, Let's do a little crossover combination. Bring both of them out. Bring Mega Man out, I mean. Oh, nice. I was trying to go for uh, that. Yeah. Ended up doing a uh, credit card. Come on. Oh, my... Dude. There we go. God, it's such a pain in the ass to try to do this with a controller. Or duo team attack is what it's called, not crossover Don't combinations. No, that's crossover combinations when we do um, both of our supers at the same time. And that's it. Yeah. No, it's duo team attack. Oh, we still got to fight Chun-Li. Oh, God. <laughs> okay, this is where she blocks a lot. We are better. Ready. Fight! God, it's such a pain in the ass to try to do a super jump with a damn D-pad. I think I've mentioned this already, but I'm playing with a Xbox One controller, and yeah. Makes me wish I was playing on an actual arcade stick. Yep. I wish I was. Nice! Damn. Oh. No! Royal Flush, man! Alright, whatever. At least I got him there. Good God. Oh. Oh, good job. What a waste of meter. At least it's not for Chun Lee. Some of these steam in this game was actually pretty good too. Oh, like I said, they were all good. All the songs are pretty good in this game. I don't, I don't think I can find a song in this game that I didn't like. Let's finish it with this. You know, I think now that I remember, I think the Dreamcast version of this game. Uh, had like an extra. Well, it did have a mode called Cross Fever. I never actually, you know, played that that mode because um, you needed four Dreamcast controllers, and I I only had two. <laughs> um, oh yeah, here's the final boss onslaught. I really hope this character actually shows up in X Men '97 in one of the later seasons. I hope that'd be pretty badass. Considering what happened in that show so far, I think it's gonna eventually. It might happen. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, what was I saying? Oh yeah, cross fever. So I guess apparently when we do the uh, duo team attack and call in, oh god, call in our uh, our special partner. I guess technically the other player could take control of them at the same time. At least I think that's what it's supposed to be. But uh, yeah, like I said, I never I never had four controllers on my Dreamcast, so could never play that mode. That'd be pretty cool if you could actually do that in this one. Like, go online in this game and actually play that cross fever mode, but I, I doubt it. Yeah, I doubt you can do that. Alright, hold on. I think I want to beat this with uh, Mega Man. You serious? No, no, I shouldn't have bothered with that. There you go. Kick to the face. Now behold my mighty hand. Yeah, I want to beat this with Mega Man. No one is safe. I really hope I don't accidentally kill him with Gambit. <laughs> oh crap. Nope. Better get rid of that. Oh crap. Yeah. I don't like the fact that Mega Man doesn't really have much health either. No, no! <laughs> I want to make sure that everybody knows what happened here today. And now I can't. Nope, nope, get that crap away from me. Move, move. Oh, crap, dude. No! I was just trying to fill up my meter. Damn. The dream is not dead. I got more quarters.
Ah. <laughs> Thought it was gonna be perfect. Alright, it's all good. It's all good. Alright, let me pick Gambit first, because I don't want Mega Man to get hurt that much. Oh, uh, but yeah, like I was saying, I really hope this character does show up in X-Men 97. I really, really hope so. Because they kind of planted the seeds a little bit in that show so far, so... We'll see what happens. Oh, crap. No, no! No, no! Wrong move. Ah, damn it! Oh, come on! He has no health left! Just kill him. <laughs> Alright. So yeah, guys, I was I demonstrated in that last attempt how to die in this game, so... Here you go, this is how you beat the game. Oh! Oh, nice! Oh, crap. No, no, no! I'm dead. Yeah, the chip damage would have killed me. Woo! Nah, that's BS! No, no, no! Oh, dude, come on! Oh my god! Oh, are you serious? This is supposed to spawn below me! Let's do that! Behold my mighty hand! No, he did it again! Oh my god! Damn, I don't remember him spamming that hand attack that much. <laughs> Alright. Hey, you know what? Hold on a second. I want to check something really quick. Ah, okay. Yeah, easy select. Oh, wait, can we not play as Onslaught in this? I know the original, um... Well, yeah, the Dreamcast version and the PlayStation version, too, um, would allow you to play as Onslaught. No, my name is Riri. I am Onslaught. Fight! Oh, dude, I'm ducking, really? No, no, no! Ah, that move. Oh, okay. <laughs> Alright. Let's keep doing that every time you do that. What was that? Oh. Oh, I like the way this is going. Oh, what the hell was that move that I was just doing there? That little roll I did? Yeah! Oh, you gotta be kidding me! <laughs> yeah, who knows? I might actually end up beating him this time. Even though things are not looking good for me right now. I still might win! Tell me this is gonna reach. No, no! Oh, good. Oh, oh, yeah, nice high jump. Yep. Yeah, yeah keep stabbing it. My God, man. Oh. oh, at least I can shoot that thing away. The hyper grab. Uh oh. Let's go, hyper. Boom, baby! Nice. First try! KO! Mega Man, win! Fun little fact for those that didn't know the original PlayStation version, the PS1 version of this game, actually allowed you to do that when you beat the game with Mega Man, and then I guess you got a. At the character select screen, you gotta hold, uh, I don't know if it was select and then any of the punch and kick buttons. 
or starred in any of the punch and kick buttons when selecting Mega Man. And it would actually allow you to do that move. That'd be dope if they added that to this version, but I doubt it. <laughs> I doubt it. Yeah, that was only in the PS1 version. Not even the Dreamcast version had that. That's pretty cool. All right, guys. Well, yep, that's it for Marvel vs. Capcom Clash of the Superheroes. Thank you guys for watching my playthrough of it. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And yeah, like I said, good times with this game back in the day. Like, man, going into that donut shop pretty much almost every day after school playing this game with my friends. Good times. I never wanted an arcade machine so bad other than this game, but one day. I'm going to make that my dream one day to actually own the actual arcade machine and not that one-up stuff. No, not that arcade one-up. The actual one. Yeah, I'm going to make that my dream just to have the actual arcade machine in my house one day. Game. But a uh, great game, you know, still good after all these years. Love it. Yeah, good times. All right, guys. Well, so we got two more games to go in this collection. Oh, and I put the wrong initials again. <laughs> I'm still used to putting that, like, a lot. Uh, yeah, we got two more games to go in this collection. The second, Marvel vs. Capcom. And then The Punisher after that, which, of course, it's, uh, it's a beat-em-up. So it's not going to be a fighting game. I mean, I guess we're, we are going to be fighting, but uh, it's more of a beat-em-up, of course. And I actually never played that game, like I mentioned. So, yeah, it'll be my first time playing that. But, uh, yeah, we're going to go on a ride in the next video. So up next is going to be Marvel vs. Capcom 2. Alright guys, well, thanks again for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And I'll see you guys in the next video.